Need some coins for that God Squad you've always wanted? For fast and cheap coins, check out instantmudcoins.com and use code ZERK for 20% off. Link is in the description. The whole thing wobbing, what, what, wobbing, what, what, wobbing. When I come around, got the whole thing wobbing, what, what. What's going on guys? It's Zerks coming at you today with another YouTube video and today I'm gonna be going over the 11 p.m. offer that we have and also some other stuff as well. Now I'm pretty sure this video will be going up after midnight so I want to say Happy New Year's and thank you guys for all the support that you guys showed me in 2020. I know it was a wild year for many 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 reasons and i just want to say thank you guys for all the support you guys absolutely killed it my best year ever on youtube we crossed over a hundred thousand subscribers towards the end of 2019 and guys we're already over 190,000 subscribers we are closing in already on 200,000 subscribers as we get into 2021 so i want to say thank you guys so much now, I do want to give a shout out to Daniel B for being a part of the Noti Gang. If you guys want a chance to be shout out in the next video, drop a like in the mid. Make sure you guys are subbed to the channel, to the notification bell line, and comment down below Noti Gang. Also, if you guys want to be under a $20 gift card, I'll be drawing the winner later tonight. All you guys got to do, drop a like in the mid, make sure you sub the channel, comment down below New Year's, and leave a way to contact you. So here is that 11 p.m. special offer. As you guys can see, it is a Zero Chill Legends bundle. So you get the Legends Fantasy Pack. And then you get the topper of the 289. So that's a normal bundle. But then it also gives you an additional 585 plus overall legend players. Do I think this bundle is actually good or worth it? I think if you buy it and you just hold it, it's probably worth it then. So that's exactly what I'm going to do. So I don't really think it's worth to buy and then open up right now, but also I do want to let you guys know that the topper does say 89 plus overall full legend. So those two toppers right there, you're not going to get a set piece. So I guess that is a little bit better because you do have a better chance of pulling like one of the full legends this weekend. Uh, and then you get the 85 plus. So I'm going to buy it, but I'll open it up in Saturday's video. So now that it is officially past midnight, I want to say officially now, Happy New Year's. And as you guys can see, we actually do have a midnight special offer. We have the Series 1 and 2 Redux Fantasy Pack. So everyone has two of these currently available. They're only available until 1 a.m. Eastern Time. I don't know if there's going to be anything after this. EA has never actually went ahead and released a schedule or anything, but... Of course, I got a dashboard. And while I go ahead and dashboard to get back into the game, let me go ahead and show you guys one of the 50 players coming tomorrow, and it is indeed going to be Lawrence Taylor. Uh, I expect the other two to actually be Barry Sanders and Dermani Dawson, more than likely. We will see tomorrow. I I'd imagine they'll probably tweet him out in the morning. Uh, but you guys see LT right here, 92 speed with 95 acceleration that is absolutely insane uh even without being on a theme team just powered up and then with sprinter you're looking at 95 speed holy crap that is just nuts also he does have 91 block shed and a 95 power move with a 92 finesse move and there is not even a reason for me to go ahead and compare him to any rights and linebackers in the game because it is not even close he is about three times as good as any right outside linebacker in the game right now this lt card is actually ridiculous so now that i'm back actually in the game and now i can go ahead and open up this pack for you guys now what i recommend you guys do if you're going to go ahead and get this uh i'm gonna be honest this is almost a ten dollar pack and really there are no super expensive options in here right because i mean we have all these 90 overalls these 91s these 92s and then we have some select 93 overall players so really the best options here just go with whoever you think or whoever is the most expensive or whoever you can actually go ahead and replace on your team, I suppose. Although it's not an NAT pack, it's just an auctionable one. So uh, LT, he's probably going to be dropping a lot in price. LT, that card right there, probably going to go down a lot in price. Deion Sanders, Mike Vick. These are probably the best two options here, seeing as how Dion, uh, tomorrow we get the free Dion Sanders, I guess technically today, we get that free, the 50 Dion Sanders, if you guys played all your solos, you got all your stars done, you get that fantasy pack, that means that more people are actually going to need to go ahead and power up Dion Sanders, the Pikmin is there in a T1, so Dion and Vic, probably the best two options, because people are definitely going to go ahead and pick them with their free, the 50 player pack, I'm going to buy one of these. I don't really think it's worth buying two of them because I don't think Dion or Vic are going to be that crazy. Uh, but let's go ahead and check out the auction house. I'll see if there's like a new LTD at midnight. I don't think 
there is, but uh, we can definitely check that out. But if we go ahead and take a look at the series redux market here for these players, let's take a look at the 92 to 93s. We should see Dion and Mike Vick uh, probably crashing a ton, to be honest, you guys. Uh, let's take a look here and see what they're looking like. So currently, Mike Vick, you guys can see him right there in the bottom right of the screen. So he's probably like 100K, if even. Uh, and then Dion is 88,000 coins. So is it worth it to get? Maybe. If you want to, I don't recommend you take a player right now and sell them. I'd say you hold on to them tomorrow or hold on to them even longer. Kind of similar to how we did with the first Blitz promo when everyone was taking like Darren Waller and all them. Uh, I would definitely just hold on. But let's go ahead and take a look actually at the market and we'll see in general if there is any new players because I, I actually don't know if there is like another uh, Blitz LTD. You know, last year they dropped like a Daniel Jones LTD at midnight. I don't know if there is one. And you guys can see it doesn't look like there is. So is there not like a new LTD? That's a little bit disappointing. But let's see what the prices are looking like here on Heinz Ward. You guys see 715,000 coins. Honestly, not a bad price at all for Heinz Ward. That card is incredible. But let's go ahead and end this video off with a couple of packs here. Let's just see if we can get lucky. Let's see if we get that New Year's luck. Last year, I actually did pull Daniel Jones. Uh, so maybe I'll get lucky and pull Heinz Ward here. Probably not, but maybe I'll get lucky. Let me know down below what you guys are doing for New Year's. Round number two here, though, we do get 283 overalls. Round three, we get a 91 Chase Claypool. That's solid. And we get a 91 Tyler. I feel like Tyler's probably the move. I know he's around 50,000 coins. Uh, by the way, guys, when it comes to like, are we going to be getting any more special offers? This does expire and new stuff will be at a one. I, I don't know actually if new stuff can be at a one or at least that does expire and there could potentially be stuff. But as I said, EA has not ever released an official schedule for the Blitz. I don't know if this is just like a one day thing or if there's going to be more as you get a Frank Clark quick sell right there. Round number two, we just get one of these. That's kind of bad. Round three, Please. Glitchy. 93 Geno Atkins. There we go. All right. Let's end it off with a couple of these zero chill ghost men pass packs. But guys, thank you guys so much for all the support this year. You guys were absolutely incredible, man. Absolutely incredible. We get a 92 overall Brian Young. I'll do a couple of these. We'll just see if we get lucky and if we, you know, somehow end up pulling that uh, Heinz Ward. I'll probably flip out. We get a Jamie Collins there. Not good luck. Not good luck at all. We'll do like three more packs. So we'll see what we get. Someone glitchy. Please. Kyle, you check. Okay, that's 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 not good at all. Two more packs. I'll give it a chance. Please give me Heinz Ward. Because I actually will probably keep that card on my team. Although I do have much faster wide receivers. That card is an exception. Just because of how good of a run blocker he is. And also the fact that he's not super, super slow. And he has great hands, great rounding. That card is just incredible. And we ended off with a Bryant Young. So let's do one more. We got a 92 overall. Let's do one more here. Come on. Heinz Ward. Boom. Nope. Jamie Collins. All right. So with that being said, guys, I hope you enjoyed the video. And if you did, make sure to drop a like on the video. And of course, hit that sub button down below. We have Lawrence Taylor coming tomorrow. I'm going to say Barry Sanders as well, potentially coming tomorrow. We'll see you in the morning, I suppose. But I hope you guys did enjoy the video. Make sure to drop a like on it. I'll see you guys next time.